finished worship practice and now I'm at the mercantile. My mom is meeting me here and we are going to start working on the brick. But I walked in and we have a really cute delivery that came. Um, I'm so excited. There's a shop online that I've loved for years. So I found their vendor and where they get all their stuff. And so we are going to be carrying all, a whole bunch of this cute stuff. But remember I was saying we were going to do aprons for us. So all of us will wear aprons in here. Look how cute these aprons are. Look how cute they are! Who doesn't love some black and white check? I guess it's a gingham, but so, so cute. They have little pockets in it. So I think this is, we've ordered so many aprons, but this is the one, right? We love yeah, this one. Really like so the whole Fox crew will wear these cute little aprons. So you'll know it's us, adorable girls. The roof is almost finished. I'm so excited. So. I was talking about this on the live, but I really wanted white metal because I just really wanted it. And so it did take a little bit longer for us to get it here, but the look is just so, so good. Like it's just exactly what I wanted with this wood color, the white, and it just is, makes such a scene. And then did you see the floor got done in the pergola? So it's all stained and it's like literally stunning. I'll share this again. This is, I'll write the name, I have to look it up, but it, I know the color was grage, grage, sorry, but it's the perfect shade. All the electrical's done and ready to go, woo! Mama's here, we're gonna start on the brick. So we're gonna start with a whitewash on it. It basically looks like a whitewash right now with just them grouting it. But some places the red uh, definitely shows through more. And when you like kind of wipe this and get it wet, it definitely wipes off. So it needs something on it to seal it no matter what. <laughs> See here, we're totally fine. All right, we're gonna use a roller. We're gonna try a roller technique and then we also have a sponge. We're gonna start with this, see how we like it. And if it's not the feel that I'm wanting, then we're definitely just gonna paint over and we're gonna go with paint. But this is a great option just to not like rush into it and make sure it'll take a couple hours, if even that, just to see if it's the look I wanna go. Cause I have two different directions. Like I've drawn it out and I can see them both, but um, I just, I just don't know because they're both really good. That's the, that's the problem. I like both of them. So this will be a good way for us to test it out. So let's get to paint. All right, so we have a can of paint that was full. We emptied out half of it into a trash can, a clean trash can. And then we filled the rest of it up with water. So it's about half paint, half water. We're shaking it up and we're first gonna try actually sponges first to see if we like that. Um, and it'll be a much quicker application.
ended up going with a color that I actually wasn't expecting. Um, it's Bear, and it's called, oh no, I'm sorry, it's not Bear, it's Sherwin-Williams, and it's Escape Gray, number 6185. I'll share that I got a color match um, made at Home Depot, but it's gonna match our business and pleasure, sage, um, fringe, umbrellas, and just add that like uniqueness to the outside that I really wanted. I wanted to, I love black and white, it's a classic, it always looks good, I'm so sweaty. Oh, it's a do, you know. Um, but a lot of people around here are doing black and white on everything, and I always want to be set. Like that's what I was saying. Like never to get so comfortable in the things that you love, and to not be open to something new and to change. So that's what I was like. You know, we're gonna do something a little bit different. So it'll be set apart. So we're gonna have black sage, the white brick, whitewash brick, and then the little yellow and white. I think it's perfect. I love Kiwi Co so much. After school, don't want the kids watching TV, want their hands busy, their minds learning. Gabe just made this um, hoverboard, a hover disc. Hoverboard, hover disc. Hey, it's not Back to the Future, okay? Um, it's so cool. I have another 50% off code. Um, if, you're, if it's your first month, you get 50% off. These are just such great gifts or after school activities or just anything to keep them busy. One more thing that I'm so excited came back in finally is our butter blankets. Like so good that I actually have two of them. One, two, black and white, honestly good for all year round. So excited about this launch, lots of good vintage up. Um, yeah, and now Dino and I are gonna go on a date. We we're going to do our marriage live tonight and I am so sorry, but I was like, our whole marriage live is being intentional about dating one another. And so we decided to go for a date instead. So <laughs> we're gonna do the marriage live this weekend, I promise. Saturday, okay? Saturday. Okay, date night. It was good. Always good. Saturday, we're gonna do a marriage live. And then next week, we're gonna be finishing up the. Now I have a clear very clear vision on what i want to do with the front of the building now that we whitewash everything and i figure out the sage <sighs> what you ruined my 